very soon. Next up is a story with Spotify. So Spotify just leaked another look at what people are calling the car thing. <laughs> it doesn't have an official name yet from Spotify, but um, Spotify has been working on a product that's going to potentially go inside of a car. It has like a knob on one side, a couple of buttons on the top, and it looks sort of just like... Um, either like a mini tablet or like a phone, but it'll be positioned in a car. And it's just a car gadget that's a voice controlled music player that allows you to access Spotify. They've been working on this for a while now. Um, we first heard about it back in 2019, it was formally announced. And this has been in their testing facilities. You know, they've been testing this, working on this for a while now. And we haven't seen any real designs on it yet, but we first got, um, pictures of it just the other day um, uh, on Mac Rumors, contributor Steve Moser found the images in Spotify's app code and these renders, these pictures match up quite closely with the photographs of the real deal submitted as part of filings to the Federal Communications Commission, the FCC. And um, it's a pretty big deal. So my opinion we have some renders, we have some, you know, designs that we've seen, but it doesn't mean that this product is actually going to go to market. It doesn't mean that they're actually going to sell it. We don't, you know, they have no formal launch date of the product. We don't know if they're actually even going to end up doing it, but seeing that um, they have filed with the FCC, seeing now the app, the in-app renders and hearing a little bit more about it, all, more and more information we continue to hear about this product, the more and more likely it's going to be to actually release. My opinion, do I think it's going to release? I don't know. For me personally, I'd probably just use my phone. I wouldn't use this. I, I wouldn't use something like this for Spotify. I'd much rather just use my phone with the Spotify app on it, just plug it in with a USB, and I'm good to go. But who knows? I, I think as more and more electric vehicles start getting produced and the infotainment systems and cars get better and better, I don't see people buying this, at least a lot. There's, there's definitely a market for it, but it's not a product, in my opinion, that would be a massive home run for years to come, just based on what I've heard about it. They could have some really cool features that oh, I don't know about, but essentially what they've spoken about is that originally they were testing the product to help Spotify um, and their developers and how and their developers better understand how to actually better understand what users are listening to and better understand like listeners habits while on the go and traveling so that's what it was originally used for but but now i just see as the infotainment systems and cars get better i don't know if this is going to be something that is really going to be widely adopted if it does ever get released but pretty cool that we do see new renders um in-app renders of this um, it does look pretty, pretty cool.